Back on December the 13th, as a part of Minecraft Preview 1.20.60.23, the armadillo was officially added to Minecraft. However, not everyone was too happy with its reveal, leading to quite a bit of backlash and even a response from Minecraft's art director. In this video, we're going to be covering all of the latest information that you need to know about straight from Mojang Studios itself. So if you're hyped, do not forget to subscribe for more Minecraft news like this, and let's dive straight into it. So then, just in case in case you've been living in the nether, let's start with a very quick recap as to why the Minecraft community is so upset with the new armadillo mob. On December the 13th, it was announced by Jay Wells, Minecraft's community manager, that the armadillo and wolf armor are ready for experimental testing in this week's Minecraft beta and preview. This is where the issues did actually start to shine through. Not only did the armadillo's appearance get changed, making it look very out of place, but also the long-awaited wolf armor, one of the main reasons people voted for the armadillo turns out to be a lot weaker than we initially thought. This obviously resulted in a ton of frustration but also led to the creation of a ton of memes which I guess is a positive. However, it does actually seem that this frustration made its way back to Jappa, a game art director and pixel artist working at Mojang Studios, who responded on December the 14th, saying the eyes of the armadillo are in the front because when they are on the side, you're looking at an empty forehead. It's difficult to create a connection with it. Considering it is a mob which you all interact with, possibly quite often, I felt like this was important. This response is key because it does highlight how Jappa, as an art director in some way did play a part in the armadillo's texture being updated, which will explain why as we go further into the video we appear to see Jappa get slowly more and more upset at the responses from the Minecraft community. Jappa then came back with another response, saying its head peeks out and it's balled up because we thought it would be funny or cute, but apparently people prefer realism. As you can probably tell it does appear that this feedback is actually beginning to frustrate Jappa. In my opinion, this post made it even worse. Where Jaffa says, Before giving your feedback, make sure to play with the feature for a while. Looking at images or videos of new things is not the same as experiencing and interacting with it. As you can see, despite large parts of the Minecraft community being in agreement that this just does not look right, Jaffa is continuing to double down on the art team's decision. Most recently, on December the 18th, Sly Slime, the tech lead for Minecraft Java Edition at Mojang, did announce the latest Minecraft Java Edition snapshot 23w51a, where we finally get to play with the armadillo on Java Edition, and as you can see in this image provided by Sly Slime, the armadillo's eyes are still in the same place. So despite for once the entire Minecraft community being in agreement about this one thing, it does appear that for right now at least, Jappa is refusing to change this. As you can see on screen, the reason for this is that the team fears that if they do move their eyes back to the side of the armadillo's head, they fear that people will ask them to move the eyes back, which let's just say does not make too much sense. Jappa, just to be completely honest, I really do not think anyone will give you this feedback if the change is made unless they are trolling. As you can see on screen, I did a poll on my community tab asking if you would like to see the armadillo's texture be updated, and a stunning majority of around 90% did agree that yes, the texture should be updated, and I do understand that this does not represent the entirety of the Minecraft community, but it does just give you an idea at least as to what the Minecraft community currently thinks about the armadillo's updated texture. Finally though, to end on a bit more of a positive note, Jappa does say, I do really appreciate the passion we have around the position of eyes of one mob here. Still though, as of when I'm recording this, it is very unclear as to whether the armadillo's texture is actually going to even be updated. I skimmed over this earlier, but going back to Sly Slime's previous post, we did just receive the armadillo in Java edition, and there is still no sign of the mob's texture being updated. So despite the vast majority of the Minecraft community agreeing that this is a change that should be made, will Jappa and the entire rest of the Minecraft art team continue to ride out this feedback and people do not care anymore, or will they do the right thing and just admit they made a mistake and fix it? It seems to me that Jappa made this change thinking it would be better for the mob, realised people did not enjoy it, and now Jappa 
but is trying to convince people that the right change was actually made. The reason I've shown you all this meme at the start of the video is just to highlight how inconsistent some of Mao Zhang's decision making can be at times. Although the logic behind the change makes perfect sense, it just does not fit with the rest of the game. And just to highlight another inconsistency that I mentioned in my previous video, the fact that the armadillo's food source is spider eyes, a food that actually damages you when you eat it, makes even less sense, especially when you consider Mao Zhang did not add fireflies to the game as the frog's food source because in real life they can be harmful to frogs. It just seems that some of Mao Zhang's developers can have a tendency to massively overthink certain aspects of a Minecraft update. If you go back to the original reveal trailer for the armadillo, as well as some of the most recent concept art we have received, there was no doubt in anyone's mind that the armadillo's eyes would be at the side of its head, but for some reason, as you can see, the change was still made. The legend Echo did respond to one of Jappa's previous statements, saying when it based on real animals, yes, yes we want realism. When it comes to recreating a real world animal in Minecraft, of course the developers should not mess with the way it looks. And yeah, just to give Jappa a bit of credit here, I do kind of understand the reasoning behind this decision to make the interactions more personal, but that brings up another point. Jappa does say you will most likely be interacting with this mob quite a bit, but I completely disagree with that. I do not really think anyone will be spending too much time with this mob apart from when they want to go and collect scoots. Thankfully for us though, the armadillo is still in very early development, so there is still plenty of time to get this changed, so please drop your thoughts and opinions about this down below in the comments. Would you like to see the armadillo texture be updated? We've already saw the developers at Mahjong Studios make changes as a part of Minecraft 1.21, more specifically with the Breeze. There's an amazing team at Mojang Studios of people that really want to make the game the best it can possibly be. One lesson we could all learn from this entire situation is that if it's not broke, don't fix it. No one had an issue with the way the armadillo looked in the reveal trailer or the concept art, so it's quite unfortunate that this change was made despite no one really caring about it at all. And hopefully very soon we will see the different colour variations of the armadillo as shown shown in some of the early concept art. I just hope this will not take too much away from the development time, but I'm starting to be a bit concerned if we will even see this fixed before the end of the year. The latest snapshot we just received was dropped on December the 18th, and around this time Mojang does go on vacation for the holidays, so potentially we could be looking at a wait all the way until late January or early February. For more Minecraft news and information be sure to check out this video on screen right now before it disappears off your screen where we talk a lot more about the armadillo and some more recent Minecraft 1.21 news.